every day at Alice Alexander Elementary starts the same with a warm welcome. Good morning. And a smile. It's impossible for these kids to come into this building and not feel welcome, which is fitting because that's exactly the way Alice Alexander would want it. If you came in contact with, with, with Mrs. Alexander, you got a hug and a smile. Smile came first and then the hug. She just exuded um, a happiness, you know, and joy to give to, to all people, you know, and to, to love everyone. Alice loved the people of Denton schools most of her life. She got an early start in the classroom. She taught, started teaching, you know, out of like at 17. Hers was a life dedicated to family and the kids of Denton ISD. She spent 45 years molding young minds here. It was an amazing career that did nothing less than change the way generations thought about education, which made Denton ISD a better place to be. People talk about role models. Uh, she was the role model for, for education. She was a role model for what to be, how to be. She affected the lives because she taught, matter of fact, she taught sometimes entire families, uh, the mother, the father, and the children. So she had a connection uh, throughout Southeast Denton and she always expressed, do and be the best that you can and you have to have the education. I think she just uh, had the initiative to look and see what was needed and to see what kids needed. She was just excited about giving to others, reaching out to others to make sure that they were prepared as to, to go into the world and, and do their best. This one, all right, well, let's look at it. And that's what happens every day in the school that now bears her name. Alice is no longer here to see it with her own eyes, but if she could. She would be glowing now because she just had one of those personalities. She lit up when she came into the room. You know, everybody just looked, she, you know, looked at her when she came to the room. And she would be lighting up to me when she, to see the name on the building. She would be honored to know that somebody thought enough of her to ask. And she'd be more than thrilled to know that it actually came true. But that would not have been something that she would have sought. But she'd be tickled to know that it happened. And she's well deserving. There are literally hundreds of people across the country that will agree with that. She was one of the most sweetest, loving, caring people that you would ever meet, period.